Yes, yes, yes. Greetings, folks. How you all doing out there? My name is Warren Jones. I'm one of the massage therapists at the Oasis Spa. Also, holistic practitioner and energy healer. And I'm here today with my friend Emily. Juan, Juan how are you doing today? I'm good. Yeah, Thanks yeah. for having me. I'm yes, super yes, yes. excited. Thanks for, for stopping by. You know, the world-renowned Epoctes Health Institute in yeah. West Palm Beach, Florida. Yeah, man. <laughs> I'm what we call a freegan, so a freegan? I'll eat anything that's mm. free. <laughs> a lot of mercy. I realized from slowly converting over to raw vegan that I was gaining more energy. You know wow. what I mean? So the, the medicine, the medicine is in the food. I said, if I'm working here, then I must try the lifestyle, you know? Yeah. So it took me about two weeks to kind of get into the food. Um, <laughs> my coworker said, listen, you can't work here and not eat the food. That's part of the benefit. People travel from all over the world to eat this beautiful raw food. So I said, all right, let me give it a try. People eat non-vegan taco, like cheese on it, right? Mm. Um, do you eat dairy? Well, I do eat cheese, mm -mm. even though I know it's the devil. Oh, Lord. <laughs> But I didn't Talk have to them me. to bring any cheese here or raw vegan <laughs> cheese, you know? So are you ready to dig in this taco here? Yeah. We got lots of arrays of different sprouts and stuff like that. Give you a lot of energy and protein. We got this big lettuce leaf. We got, um, we got some asparagus. We That's have some beautiful. nut meat, some dolce. This, the dolce, I like the dolce, you know why? I don't it know has what that that kinda, is. It has kind of like that meat, that meat taste. Like the know. umami? Yeah. Yes, yeah, it's what kind of crunch, crunch, crunch. Well, you're about to find out. You know. Would you like me to, um, <laughs> to prepare, prepare your taco yeah. leaf for you? Um, let, me, let me do one preparation. Okay, first. sure, yeah. All right, so Show me is, how you would this, do it. This, this is how I would do it, right? Okay. So I would do a little bit of something like some red on here. You know? Some of that stuff. Yeah, it's okay, good. it's that very good. neon. Yeah, good, 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 good. <laughs> like a three D creation. We got yeah, I like on. bright colors. All right, so okay. let's put some some of the salsa on it, right? Is that spicy? Um, if it is spicy, I wouldn't know. So we'll find out together. Right? <laughs> oh, great! I don't know. I don't know who really. <laughs> I don't know who you know. Either it's spicy. It might be good for your uh, circulation if there's some kind of Perfect. pepper in there. Some right? Raja energy. Oh, yeah. Mm -hmm. I know. All right. I so still yeah. eat meat, but I know things. All right. <laughs> Raja. You know, sustain the chi force. Yes. Mm -hmm. So you really felt a difference in your energy, like your spiritual energy body when you yeah, started eating yeah, plants. Yeah, because I feel that um, when you eat the animals now, I feel that when they're slaughtered, whether they're organic mm. or whatever, um, I feel that you are obtaining the animal spirit. You know, I notice that some people eat a lot of meat, and uh, whether it's good meat or bad meat, they, they, they have these weird moods. You know, you know what I mean? If you look at it spiritually, it's yeah. like you're, you're, you're taking on the mood of the, the animal. A, like an it, animal that was horrified right before it died. Exactly. You know, mm. animals that were separated from ma from mama, ma from mama goats and mama cow and whatnot. You know, actually, That's convincing. actually, when I when I when I was, cause I never liked red meat growing up. I thought it was gross. Anyway, so let's get back to our food. Is this like a mushroom or bark or oh. rose petals? Uh, it's just something beautiful. Let's say that you know. You know, that's a seaweed. All right. I'm gonna try it separately. Lots of minerals in seaweed, right? Holy crap, that's crunchy. You know, <laughs> and then um, yeah, I'm gonna mm. put some sauce on it for you. Yeah. Put some of the onion Which sauce. One? And that you like looks. Onions? I do. Oh, okay, good. That kind of yeah. looks like sour cream. Onions make your breath fresh. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Mixed with garlic. Yeah. <laughs> Seaweed does it, too. Is that enough um, <laughs> onion juice there? That's beautiful. So, I don't know how neat you are if you um, like eating on in public or not, but me, I go in and I would extra stuff it with some of the olives oh, and some okay. of the... Back home, they say it's bad manners to have your jacket on a dinner oh. or a hat, because it's good, right? Yeah. All right, so, um, so you say you eat meat? I do. You're still eating meat? Mm hmm Yeah, okay. I eat pretty much everything. Okay, which so. Which I know is like not okay Do you to want to give meat up or? <sighs> it's, a, it's a hard thing. No judgment, so. I'm a foodie, so I really like 
the experience of like really sexy food and like the sensual pleasure of eating really fancy things. So you're like eating, <laughs> you're eating a sexy cow and it's a veggie. Yeah, <laughs> when it's all dressed up. But I have been uh -oh. to like fancy vegan restaurants, fine dining that's vegan, and uh -huh. I'm just as excited about that, truly. Okay, so you're telling me that you like meat, but you just don't want to give it up. Yeah. Or you haven't found a reason to give it up I yet. haven't found a reason. Oh, okay. Well, see, you, yeah, you a good watch, reason. Well, you need to watch one of those documentaries about how they slaughter animals or something like that, right? I'm going to take a Since bite of my taco. So I think you've been to Toronto? Mm -mm. Okay. Mm, oh, I'm, I'm, I'm disturbing your, your, um, your creation there. Um, I. This is your creation. Yeah, <laughs> no, 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 that is true. Did you put some olives on there. Mm. All right. I don't remember. All right. Let me let me <laughs> let me try let me try and dig in and see what's going on here. Right. This is good. Let me see. Mm hmm. And the answer is slightly spicy. Mm. <laughs> it's good. It's really good. Mm -hmm. Good enough for you to give up meat? We'll see, it's a big ask, but um, if I had this available to me all the time, like you guys have here, mm -hmm. absolutely. So um, when you say available to you, you mean that it's not, a con it's not convenient for you to, to go out and buy these products or prepare or go somewhere? Right. Mm -hmm. Why not? I go grocery yeah. shopping like once a week or I send my partner to do it. Mm. <laughs> so um, you seem like a very active woman and so forth. So mm -hmm. um, don't you think this would help you um, eating this way more to be uh, productive in, in your activities as far as fitness? Are you fitness, uh, what do you do? So Are I'm a dancer yoga? and a performer and mm -hmm. a yogi mm -hmm. and a spiritual explorer. Mm -hmm. And I do all these things I have let that be a block to eating more healthily, and I kind of know that. But it's just like another of the layers that I'm gonna have to peel off. So you don't think that, um, oh, don't forget about the corn now, it's raw. It's raw corn? Mm-hmm. Oh. I didn't like the idea of that at first, but you know, that's how it is, you know what I mean? Mm-hmm. Yeah, but I think that eating this way mm. would um, open up some channels for you in your um, fitness and your yoga, you know, to be more mindful and your mindfulness and so forth. Right. Eat hot vegan food. Because I need something hot in my system in the oh, evening time. Oh, okay. So you're you know, not fully raw vegan all um, the time. Well, for me, I realize when I eat raw, it's digest better between 12 p.m. and 4 p.m. Mm. So I like a warm vegan food in the evening pork, right? Oh, yeah. We like to do that in the winter, too. Up yeah, where I'm yeah. from. You know. <laughs> so I've been over here enjoying my food mm. while you've been telling me about your vegan mm -hmm. diet. I, I appreciate it. Way? No, I just oh, okay. want you to have time to eat. So okay, I thought cool. maybe you would want to hear a joke. Mm, I like jokes. Okay. Ready? It's it's a vegan approved joke. Let me get prepared okay. for the joke. Yeah, don't spit. So, do you know what the coolest vegetable is? It's a radish. Oh, whatever. <laughs> Are you serious? I love dad jokes. Oh, man. Yeah. <laughs> um, radish. Um, all right. I'll just eat this. You rad that. radish. Mm -hmm. <laughs> mm. Okay, awesome. so raw corn. Yeah. It's so why do we boil it if we can eat it raw? Mmm. It's sweet, it's right? It's great. Yeah, man. That's mm. wild. Corn cheers. Cheers. Blessings, yeah. <laughs> Almost, if you put something below it, it could be like a champagne flute. You know what I mean? <laughs> Most people don't think corn's exciting, but when I started working here, I said, man, mm. I gotta try this corn here. So this is actually the, the dessert. It is very sweet compared because to everything a, we just ate. There's a thing called food combination. And, and try not to drink before you eat either, you know? Okay, we grow up an in a society. hour after. Like an hour after. We grow up in a society where we have to eat, drink, eat, and drink. We do too much. Yeah. Oh, yeah. multitasking. Yeah, yeah. We just enjoy the mm -hmm. moments. That's Guilty. what we're living in the now, right? I love it. All right. Thank so, you. So do you feel that this is something that you uh, can implement to your life? And I think that I can put a meal like this together at least a few times a week to start. Mm -hmm. And as I can like keep learning more, I can do more. This is amazing. I'm going to eat the rest of this off camera so I don't have to be dainty. Oh, okay. Just want everybody to know we're here at Hippocrates Health Institute. This is where we help people, body, mind, soul. Food healing is very important. It's helped me a lot. 
My name is Warren Jones. I gotta get to work. I got some people to massage today. Yeah. And this food right here is giving me the energy. I'm telling you, energy. I love it. Mm -hmm. Thank you. It was nice well, having lunch with you. Oh, lesson, lesson, lesson. Cheers. Mm. Thank you, Cheers. my friend. Cheers. And I'll be a better vegan next time. Bless it, bless it. 100% vegan, all right? Yeah, man. Thank you. Thank you, everyone. Come on down to West Palm Beach and have yourself a nice raw vegan dish here at Hippocrates Health Institute. Mm -hmm. Yeah, man. It's Warren Jones. <laughs> <laughs> respect. Yes, oh, Warren. Yeah. Respect. Yeah. Oh, wow.